and what's up guys it's Paget Gaming here welcome to my first episode of Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic KOTOR 1 the first ever Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic that came out and we're going to be playing this because 1 we're under quarantine and 2 because I'm going to play some old Star Wars classics and we're going to do this from the beginning to the end and see sort of how much I remember of the game and how much I remember of the combat system and how much I remember of how to fight and everything like that and we're gonna get into a new game here and we are gonna play as a what are we gonna play as a scoundrel or a scout we're gonna play as a male scout obviously custom character what head are we gonna put in here hmm We'll go with this head because this is the head that most looks like Revan in the later games, the Swore and I think it is just Swore that he shows up in after this and that's the head that looks most like him. Obviously to start off with I put all my attributes up to 13. That is the first thing I always do because it evens out and everything's nice and even and then because I'm going to go consular I can focus on wisdom and intelligence and constitution I believe. And we're going to press OK. Now with skills, I'm going to go with... So I go with Persuade. I'll get one on Persuade. Uh, four on Treat Injury. Four on Demolitions. Four on Computer Use. And I'm going to put one last one on Persuade. Because Persuade is always a good feature to have. And we're going to go for this one as a bonus to melee weapons. And the name, we're going to call him Paget, like that. There we go. Now guys, the only mod that I have installed on this is Jedi from the start. And it's only because I've played this game so many times before in the past. And... I don't really enjoy the Endar Spire that much because I've played it hundreds of times. So I thought I'd add in a little bit of Jedi from the start so that it's not quite so boring and we get our lightsaber straight away and the dialogue changes as well so that helps out a lot. Now we're obviously going to skip that for copyright issues. Now in this series guys I will be being quiet a lot and that's not just for your sake but for mine because I believe listening to the game and listening to the storyline of this game is a big part of it um, especially with it being an offline game with only the story to play and I just want you guys to sort of immerse yourselves in the stories you're watching this so I won't be talking as much but I will be talking in between cutscenes and as we do quests and as we go off and do other little things like Pazark and the sweep racing and everything like that and now I said we're going to go a consular with the green lightsaber um, which there we go gives us one point on persuade like that and here I want to get what do I want to get here I believe I want to get this one. This feat provides a plus one bonus to all saving throws. Excellent physical condition. I feel like I want this one. Take less hits and force powers don't really get us as much. And now here I want effect mind and stun. Because we're going to be a light side Jedi. We are not going to take any of these dark side moves. We are only going to take the light side ones like force push, um, force suppression, throw lightsaber. And some of these as well, some Force Aura and things like that to help our teammates fight better. And that's the route we're going to go here. Let's collect our stuff. Our nice apprentice robes, our lightsaber. Our cardio package gives us some constitution. That's very nice. Look at him. There we go, look at Paget there. So yeah guys, like I said, I really want you to immerse into the storyline in this. This is Cardinal Nassi. 
The Sith are threatening to overrun our position. We can't hold out long against their firepower. All hands to the bridge! So, we need to get to the bridge. Um, another thing in this series, guys, I will be learning individual things about other characters so that I can talk about them pretense and after KOTOR 1. Um, so like Karthanasi, I'm gonna learn out, I'm gonna in between videos learn stuff about him so I can talk about him during the video and the same with some of the other characters that come along in the game just to bring up more conversation within the video and down in the comments section afterwards. <laughs> I mean, he's really one unlucky soldier. He's been really left behind. Okay, they're um, they're pretty good at defending their throws. Let's get a little bit of that combat in. Oh, okay, that didn't last long. <laughs> we literally just one hit him with our saber. Oh, we're gonna go hit the other one now. Maybe not a good idea. Let's just go straight for him. Oh, we got both of them meleeing us now. Let's watch some of this combat. There we go. Has he dropped anything? Oh, when the game wants to let me move. Oh, he did drop stuff. A repair kit and adrenal stamina. Some more swords. So a grenade. Actually, grenades come in handy. Okay, don't let me use the med pack then. I mean, the Sith are pretty brutal in this game. Like, we just watched them grenade one of their own. Like, how full on is that? We're just gonna do the same back. As easy as that. And then we can get these two. No, 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 not a grenade. We're gonna unclick that. I'm gonna hit you with a flurry twice. Oh, well there we go. Nice and easy. Check we are still recording. Always got to double check. I mean, it's really important, guys, in this game that you pick up everything as well, because you never know what you might miss, and you never know what might come in handy in this game as well. Ah! Oh, he survived! Since when was that a thing? Where's his other lightsaber gone? I never knew that was a thing. I mean, that is awesome. Not sure when that became an add-on. It might be part of the um the add-on that I've got. Cause I think I tried putting it like the TLC patcher on but it didn't work and that might be like one of the files I missed. But I mean I, that's pretty cool. Not gonna lie. This game is a little bit glitchy still though. I mean, definitely gonna put that on. Why not? 
I mean, all these years on, and I still love the combat system in this game. I still think it's really good. Alright, so we want to heal here. Like so. I mean, the game is a little bit slow to respond after I use med packs and stuff. Um, not sure if that's because of the mod or just the game in general at the moment. But, uh. Yeah. Oh, there's Trask. I mean, he's pretty dead. The, the Sith must have already been and killed him. This is Carth Onassi on your personal communicator. I'm tracking your position through the Endar Spire's life support systems. Basilis escape pod is away. You're the last surviving crew member on the Endar Spire. No, I can't wait for you much longer. You have to get to the escape pods. Right, so we're almost at Carth now. I want to get a stun off. But I don't think my force powers are- Oh, there we go. There's me whinging about it and we finally get one off. Ha ha ha, just to smack him up. Lovely. I mean, he really didn't stand a chance against us. Poor guy. Be careful. There's a whole squad of Sith troopers on the other side of that door. You need to find some way to thin their numbers. I mean, I'm really sorry for that guy. I mean, he didn't really stand much of a chance. I'm literally just going to use the security console. It's a nice, lovely way. Watch them all fry. Ha ha ha. Lovely. Is that everyone? Yeah, everything's looted, and then we're gonna talk to Calf. You've made it just in time. There's only one active escape pod left. Come on, we can hide out on the planet below. Basila's escape pod's already gone, so there's no reason for us to stick around here and get shot by the Sith. Now, come on, there'll be time for questions later. So guys, this is going to be the end of episode 1 of the playthrough. If you've enjoyed this video, leave a like. And if you've enjoyed it even more, leave a comment down below letting me know what colour lightsaber you want me to have in the future. Uh, things like what armour you'd like me to have, things you'd like to see me do. If you'd like me to complete every quest, if you'd like me to complete every light side quest, everything like that. If you'd want me to play some Berserk, just let me know down in the comments guys. And I will read them all and get back to you. Even if it's just a general comment about the game. I will reply to you and kind of get the best answer that I can. But anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.